Hey there, it's Lady with a mic, and I am back with another M I T A L. Wait, wait. See, I was on a roll, and then I think I spoke too soon because now I'm over here stuttering. <laughs> I'm, well, I'm tripping over my words. With another A I T A H. Yes, or A I T A. Am I the A hole? So let's get into it. Am I the a-hole for ruining Thanksgiving after my boyfriend announced my pregnancy and his mom fainted? Child, not the mama fainting over you being pregnant. <laughs> Let's get into this. All right. So I, 20 female, went to my boyfriend, Jake's, oh, another Jake from State Farm, <laughs> 22 male family's Thanksgiving dinner last week. We'd been dating a year and this was my first time meeting the whole squad. So I was already kind of nervous. Before we left, Jake joked about how his family was super traditional and said I should be ready for some old fashioned vibes. I just laughed it off. Dinner starts and everything's fine until Jake suddenly goes, hey everyone, we have big news. I'm sitting there like, what big news? Then he grins at me and says, tell him babe, Child, I would have been looking like, tell them what? <laughs> what are you talking about? I don't even know what news you're talking about. Like, what? <laughs> I'm so panicking. So I just sit there confused. And his mom is already emotional asking if we're engaged or something. Then Jake drops, she's pregnant. Child, the, t the moment he would have said that to me, because um, apparently she's not pregnant after she didn't know what was going on, um, I... I would have probably left. I probably would have smacked Jake, not smacked Jake, but me and Jake would have had some words. I would have shared some words with Jake and then I left. Y'all, I am not pregnant. I immediately started, start denying it, but Jake's cracking up, saying it's just a joke and telling me to play along. His family isn't laughing. His mom legit faints. His dad starts yelling and his grandma's praying under her breath. Ah, I can just imagine. Like, are they like a Southern, I don't know. I, listen, what I imagine in my mind. You done stretched your mama out. Jake, the, Jake from State Farm and stress his mama out, stressing his daddy by probably stressing the mama out and then hearing this news. And then you got grandma over here, over here praying to the Lord, like this can't be happening, Lord. Fix it, Jesus, fix it. Jesus takes the wheel, okay? Grandma don't know what's going on. Grandma is praying under her brother and it's probably gonna get louder and louder and louder with the prayer, okay? It's just too much, it's too chaotic. It's too chaotic. It's too much chaos going on. I'm mortified, me as well. I stand up and go. Actually, the real joke is Jake thinking I'd stay with someone who pulled this and I walked out. Jake's been blowing up my phone saying I embarrassed him and ruined Thanksgiving. Who embarrassed who? Was it him or was it him that embarrassed somebody? Okay. His family is apparently mad at me for causing drama. What? How is the family? I, okay, I'm a little confused. Like, how is the family upset with you about causing drama? Who who actually caused the drama here? It was Jake over here talking about something. There's an announcement and one saying that you're pregnant, and you denied it. So, what? But like, I didn't announce a fake pregnancy and traumatize his mom. Literally, the mom is literally laid out on the floor. Where, where do we? Like, she is laid out. So who 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 caused who caused the drama here? Am I the a hoe for walking out and leaving him to deal with the mess? Okay, first of all, no, you're not. Um, I probably would have did the same thing because, like, honestly, if I that would have happened in front of me, I would have been mortified as well. I I would not have known what to do. I would have probably left. I would have felt very uncomfortable. I I would just go because I'm like, if I see somebody faint over that, I'm like, oh heck no. Look, she's fainted. That's that's a lot, in my opinion. Jake was he was wild for that. Jake is a menace. So to me, it sounds like Jake actually like made up that whole thing of him saying you embarrassed me and my family's upset with you for ca for causing unnecessary drama. Jake, were you just not there when you said that I was pregnant? So who actually caused the drama here? Jake, were you, were you, th were you not there? Were you not present? Where were you? She probably looked at him in confusion, like, 
what are you about to say to these folks when he said that we have an announcement? Tell them, babe, because I would have been like, tell them what exactly, Jake? What am I saying? This is what's kind of getting me a little confused as well. Is when the mother, or when she denies it, when did the mom faint? <laughs> because when she denied it, she clearly said, um, no, 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 I'm not pregnant or whatever. When Jake said she's pregnant, did the mom just automatically faint? Sounds like Jake is a prankster and he takes it too far. Second of all, I feel like if I, I know, like, if I heard her say she's not pregnant, then I would have been like, Jake, you know what? Shut up, sit down, eat your turkey. Stop playing around like that, you know? I do feel like there's a certain, <laughs> you can't really play, like, especially if you know your mom is, like, very much, like, gonna do stuff like this. You can't play around like that. Like, why do you like to see your mom laid out on the floor like that? Help her up. Get up, mom. Help her up. That's the least you could do for causing all of this ruckus. And you was the one that caused the drama, Jake, from State Farm. Not Anna. Or not Anna. What's her name? She didn't say her name. Well, I'm going to call her Anna from, like, the last story. <laughs> not Anna. Anna was the one that was sitting up here trying to figure out what the heck you about to say. Like, what what is going on? Jake was the one that was over here doing all this stuff. And I wish I could see grandma up under her breath over here saying the Lord's prayer. I just, I can just see, I can picture all of this chaos happening. Then the dog is probably barking. If they got a dog, the cat then probably shoot away. Say, I'm not dealing with this family. Y'all know how cats are. Cats are very much like, I don't, I don't like you. I'm just here for the food. Okay. You live in, you live with me. I don't even know they have a cat. I don't even know. I'm just making this up as I go. I'm making up the dog and the cats as I go. But I just feel like Jake from State Farm was absolutely wrong. <laughs> he was the one causing the drama and then trying to put it all on Anna for whatever reason. Because Jake know he was wrong. So, But instead of admitting that he was wrong, he's going to be like, oh, no, Anna, you're the one that caused all this drama. And you think that after you saying all of this to me, you think I'm going to come back to you? Okay, Jake, whatever you have to say to make yourself sleep well at night, fine. I don't care. Just know that I'm not coming back and I don't need this in my life, okay? And I think that sometimes we just have to say that. Okay, whatever whatever makes you feel better. If that's what you want to say. What uh, Chrisette Michelle say, blame it on me. You can say that it's all my fault. That's fine. Just as long as we're, we're done. We're done. We're done. I don't care. I don't care what you say. It's whatever. And that's how I feel like Anna is like, whatever. But Jake want to say that he's, he's upset with her over something that he caused, but then trying to blame it on her. Jake, grow up. How old are you, Jake? 22? 22 what it do grow up please grow up um but anyway that's all i have for you guys today um let me know your thoughts and opinions down below in the comments like do y'all feel like jake was wrong do you feel like it's just a harmless joke everybody was just overreacting um <laughs> but clearly it was it was very near and dear to my to the mother's heart <laughs> okay um do you feel like she was wrong for walking out and for leaving him to deal with the mess? Or do you feel like she should have stayed? Like, who do you feel like was wrong? Do you feel like anybody was wrong in this situation? Or do you feel like everybody was wrong in this situation? Let me know your thoughts and opinions down below in the comments. And thank you guys for joining me. And I will see you guys. Why does this keep falling? We not showing shoulder today, baby. <laughs> I'm going to keep you covered. <laughs> anyway, um, like I said, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.